Are you from in England? London. London. So you have a London accent? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Ah, okay. So, so in this, uh, I would like to practice uh, a bit British accent. <laughs> Great. Um, I have a small paragraph. Okay, that's a good idea. I was going to say. Oh my yes. God, good. <laughs> 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 Who wrote that? <laughs> Cheerio. Uh, no. Just to let it's, you know. No, it's chat no. GPT. Oh, okay. Wow. <laughs> Just to let you know. Um, no one actually speaks like this in the UK. <laughs> Who speaks like that? ChatGPT. No one. Oh, no one speaks like that. No. The day old town. No. no one speaks like that. But it's it's a great way to practice. So okay, um, um, might as well go you, for it. You'll say a few words and then I'll copy. Yeah. All right. So good day. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I just can't believe it. <laughs> Good. Can I just take a photo of the chat because that's so funny. What um, does it mean, old chap? It's just like it's old a bit friend? of a, like that's yeah, old chap is like old friend. Um, okay, a good day, old chap. But it's a British word, right, chap? Yeah, this is all British. When was it used? <laughs> Years ago, <laughs> centuries <laughs> ago. <laughs> all right, I see. So. Okay, good day, old chap. Good day, good day, old chap. Yeah, so good day, good day. Good day, so you separate the Ds. Good yeah, good day. Well, actually, if I say it quickly, good day, good day. <laughs> no, that's Australian. Um, okay. Old chap. Old chap. Old chap. Old chap. Yeah. How splendid it is to engage. How splendid. Splendid. Blended. What does it mean by splendid? It means nice, lovely. Like amazing? How amazing? Yeah, amazing. like how amazing. How splendid. Uh, what is the difference between amazing and splendid? Why would I say splendid? One's amazing. I don't know. No, no one speaks like this. <laughs> I would use amazing. I would never use splendid. Splendid. Nice. It's like posh how English. Sp oh, splendid. Ah, how spl like a royal English? How splendid yeah. it is. I know. Yeah. It is to ah. engage. Do you say, what a lovely day? Yeah, I say lovely a lot. How splendid yeah. it is to engage. In a bit of British banter. In a bit of British cat banter. <laughs> British, British. Okay, in a bit. You remove the T's? Yeah, we don't say the T's. We're in a bit of British better. Br you got a British, British. British, British better. Banter. 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 Why there's a T yeah. then? You, you are meant to pronounce the T's, but. Okay. English people okay. talk so casually. They would just say, "Oh yeah, I love British banter." Like Can that. you say like, "Engage in a bit of British"? A bit banter. of British banter. Can it's you hard. say with tears? Bit of British banter. Does people say that? Not really. Oh, they remove it simply. Well, we don't remove it intentionally. It's just by accident because of our um, of our accent. Like bottle yeah, of water. Uh, the T word is hard, right? Yeah. Posh that's, people pronounce the T's. Uh, that's why Americans just simply make a D. Water, that, yeah. Yeah, make it yeah, water. Yeah, we'll water, water. Yeah, so in American, they have their own way to make it fast, like with D yeah. sound, and you just remove it, or royal people say it. How splendid yeah. it is to engage in uh, a How, how splendid. If I was to speak in a posh accent, this is how you sound. Yes. Good day, old chap. How splendid it is to engage in a bit of bit British banter. Like, that's how they sound. Does anybody no say one, that? No, no one speaks nowadays. like that. Uh, I heard this, like, the way you said, in a prank, right? A, a guy. Yeah, it's a bit of a joke. If I was yes. to write how British people actually speak, it would be like this. All right, mate. All right, mate. Yeah, how I heard are you the today? Mate. Right, mate. All right, mate. How are you today? How are you today? Oh, okay, what, I see. What a lovely day it is. What a lovely day. Okay, and so uh, do you, uh, what was I going to say? Do you, like, use this accent uh, in a funny way? Like, how splendid I, it is and in a fun way? I mean, personally, no, because for me, for us, it's not that funny. It's mm. just posh. How about to, uh, how about the middle era, I would say? Um, 
well, who was what was his name? Uh, who? The king of literature in England. William Shakespeare. Yeah, William Shakespeare. Yeah. Does so anybody that... speak like him? No, no one. <laughs> Tell you what, you should go. You, do you have access to YouTube? Yes, I do. Right, look up, look up Love Island UK, and you can see how normal people speak. Love Island UK. Yeah. Is it a channel name? It, yeah, it's a reality TV show where young okay. people. It's a dating show, but everyone has different accents, so you can see how people really talk. Mm, I see. All right. Okay. Yeah. And, uh, so, as a casual and in a funny way, do people speak like Shakespeare? No. <laughs> Long time ago, the only people that speak like Shakespeare are the royal family, and that's it. They still use the, die, do. No. Okay. I thought you meant accent. No. No one speaks like Shakespeare. No uh, one. Yeah. Yeah, that's long if someone, gone. If someone sa speaks right now in this era to you, yeah. how would it sound like? Like the way I'm speaking. No, if if I if someone yeah. speaks like Shakespeare. Oh, I don't know. You just be like, what are you on about? I don't know. I just like what? <laughs> I just wouldn't understand what they were saying. No well, one does I, that. <laughs> so I want to ask, what are you doing? How would Shakespeare ask? I don't know. I don't really read Shakespeare. I actually grew up in Spain, so oh. I'm the wrong person to ask. You grew up in Spain? Yeah. So what was your first language? Well, English, but not Shakespeare English. Just like casual, normal uh, English. Uh, second language is Spanish. Uh, what I found from Chad Tiputi is that the, this... What do you think about it? That's how Shakespeare spoke. What art thou doing? Yeah, what art thou doing? Does it sound... What does it sound like? I cannot even say. I, I don't know. It just means what are you doing in old time language. But you know Shakespeare was like 400 years ago. Like Is we've, it, de uh, we've developed since. Right, but there's still theatres, right, that plays his... Uh, yes, so that's the only place you can go is the Shakespeare Globe in London. Mm -hmm. They still do Shakespeare plays, I think. Mm -hmm. That has to be the only place that does it. I see. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, moving on to the next line. Okay. The, so the, the, the Queen's, Queen's English. Okay. The Queen's English. I'm trying to know your uh, the pitch to like English. English. The Queen's English. With its refined pronunciation. With its refined pronunciation. And distinctive intonation. Distinctive. Why did you not remove? Can you remove T's here? Distinctive. Because that one, it needs to say distinctive. Yeah, no, distinctive. You don't remove T's here in this word, right? Distinctive. <laughs> no, honestly, I just, I remove T's when I speak fast. Like, it's not an intentional oh. thing. Can you speak fast? Like this one is a refined pronunciation and distinctive intonation. No, I would still, I would just never use these words. Like, this is so posh. I don't speak like that. It's really hard. Like, you should just send me a normal paragraph of anything and I'll Where read it. You, what about the fun in that? Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> okay. I mean, oh. I'm I teach English. I don't teach accents. Okay, I, I don't worry about that. You need to get to a dialect that. for that. Uh, okay, truly, right? Truly exemplifies. Truly exemplifies. The elegance of the British Isles. The elegance of the British Isles. What does it mean by elegance? Elegance means like fancy. Fancy. Posh. Yeah. Okay. So like if you see a woman and she's dressed really nice, mm. she's or like older women who have manners are really elegant. Mm, you look at how okay. can... What does it mean by if I say you look elegant? Yeah, it's not really a compliment. It kind of refers to older ladies who. Thank you for telling yeah, me that. Have good manners. Yeah, don't use that word, elegant. <laughs> Which what would be the alternative? Well, for, I, what's your language? I'll translate it. For uh, or compliment. Well, you just be like, oh, you look nice. Oh, you're stunning. Mm. Um, elegant is a kind of a mannerism it's not about looks the word, it's about the word, actions the word stunning you look stunning stunning like, that means mean? like beautiful it means good looking good looking stunning. 
Can I say stunning job? Yeah, I use stunning all the time. Stunning job. So okay, so stunning job means good job. Good job, yeah. Okay. Um. Okay, weather. Okay, from here. Whether you're sipping a cup of tea or strolling through the countryside. Okay. Whether you're sipping a cup of tea or strolling through the countryside. The British accent adds a touch of sophistication. Okay. The British accent adds a touch of sophistication. What does it mean by sophistication? Uh, what's your language? Let me translate it. <laughs> oh, why is it what's... Hindi? Are you Hindu? Where are you from? India. Oh, India. Let me translate. Let me translate. Sophisticated. Complicated? No, sophistication means like, it's a bit like elegant. Sophisticated means put together. Like if, if I say like, um, you sound sophisticated. Yeah, if, so, if you meet someone really posh in English, you're like, oh, you sound sophisticated. Or if I say, don't be so sophisticated. Nah, you wouldn't really say it like that. Yeah? No. Okay. Okay. And and charm to any and charm to any conversation. Com can you say the conversation again? Conversation. 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 Okay. Yeah. And charm to any and this word to 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 okay and to. charm to and charm to any conversation and charm to any conversation. Okay, I learned the two. <laughs> two yeah so let's give it a whirl and embrace and embrace okay and so let's give it a whirl and embrace okay. the nuances of this delightful accent the new nuances right? new new one new one nuances this nuances nuances yeah. of this delightful accent yeah cheerio no, cheerio. cheerio do you yeah. say that no never I say bye. What does it mean? See you later. See, it means no. goodbye. Cheerio. I'm gonna come to UK and I'm just gonna say cheerio. Cheerio. Yeah, you can. People will be like, okay. <laughs> okay. I prefer saying, all right, bye. See you later. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, mate. Bye, right? All right, okay, mate. See you okay, later, mate. mate. See you later. Okay. Okay, yeah. well, how was my English? Your English is really good. You don't even need a British accent. That's why I'm You're learning. Fine. You're fine with your accent you've got. It's got an American twang, I will say. Okay, thank you very much. But it's and good. Then, your English is really good. Yeah. Okay. See this you around. This is one of Take the weirdest care. lessons. <laughs> See you later.